Five feet. What has to be five feet? Six. Six? Well, what do you mean six? Six feet from the tip of the dorsal to the tip of the tail. So what, what the hell does that mean? It means there's a tall for great white shark in here. Now, the movie really isn't as as corny as you would expect for like, a, you know, a, a shark being trapped inside a grocery store. There is some like you know, uh, back backstory drama to like each of the characters. Some of those we don't exactly get get explained throughout the film, but uh, some of them we have seen like like the lead uh, male character and the lead female character used to go out. They were engaged at one time, but then her brother was uh, eaten by by like a a shark a, a year before so like you have that and she has a new boyfriend and uh, basically it's, it's these, these people that have some issue with probably like another person and they just have to work together and try to survive it and and get and not being being uh, eaten by by the shark now, also downstairs, but in the parking area down, there, there's another three people trapped. Um, two of them are a, a couple, so they give some like a comedy, some like comedic moments. It's pretty well, it's pretty well done. Uh, the the uh, directing to this film is actually really good. It's a really strong directing job. The uh, shark. Is a uh, part CG, part part real, you know, real against a fake little puppet, or not like a puppet, but you know, like a big thing. Um, so that that goes over pretty well. The shark CG isn't as cheesy as like some of the more uh, lower budgeted films, as as you can guess, and. Um, yeah, this this film also goes by very quickly. It is pretty action packed. The, like I said, there's like some like side drama going on during all these shark killing scenes and like tremendous shark shark kills. If you are a, a fan of shark movies, you're definitely gonna love this one because there's some pretty bloody kills it's fantastic 
and like I said, the like the acting's good, directing's you know like like above good, but not quite great. It's kind of in between there, almost great, but better than good. The, like the storyline's solid, cause like I was thinking, okay, how are are they gonna make it believable? That like a shark, you know, with a big flood. I was like, that's kind of dumb. But it overall works, and it came out pretty good. So, wrapping up on that, I am going to give this a pretty solid 7 out of 10 killer sharks. See you guys next time for another shark video.